Today on The Daily Dose, British airmen crash a Nazi party. On the 10th anniversary of Hitler's ascension to power, the British Royal Air Force sent three twin-engine bombers on the RAF's first ever daylight bombing raid over Berlin, with the intention of disrupting Luftwaffe commander Hermann Göring's pep talk to a war-weary German public. At 11 in the morning, when Göring was scheduled to address a parade from the Air Ministry building, three de Havilland mosquito bombers, known affectionately by the Brits as the Mossy or the Wooden Wonder, flew a daring low-altitude bombing raid over central Berlin, prompting one eyewitness to later report that Göring was boiling with rage and humiliation, since the successful mission completely discredited Göring's claim to the German people that enemy aircraft would never fly over the Reich. To further the hurt, during the afternoon of the same day, three more Mossies from the 139th Squadron bombed Berlin's largest indoor sports arena, where Nazi propaganda minister Joseph Goebbels was scheduled to address the day-long celebration of the Nazis' rise to power. Of the six Mossies flying over Germany that day, 105th Squadron leader D.F. Darling and his navigator William Wright were shot down near Altengrabo, Germany, taking the lives of both brave men. After the humiliating attacks, Goring would say that it makes me furious when I see the mosquito. I turn green and yellow with envy. The British, who can afford aluminum better than we can, not together a beautiful wooden aircraft that every piano factory over there is building, and they give it a speed which they have now increased yet again. And there you have it. British airmen crash a Nazi party. Today on The Daily Dose.